Alright, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to some more Doom Eternal. Last time we, we did a bunch of shit last time. We fought a boss. It was pretty fucking cool. We uh, did some stuff with Samuel Hayden, who's kind of alive, but he's in pieces. He's in one half piece, I guess, kind of. But anyway, today, before we jump back into the mission stuff, uh, I believe I have some Sentinel batteries to use to unlock some more rooms on the fortress. So let's do that first. Maybe I can, uh, I'm probably gonna unlock one of these, uh, these doors that gives me a level up. Or a sentinel crystal, I should say. Yeah, one of these bad boys. Also, here's one of the, uh, the soundtrack thingies that I, I found in one of the missions. Aubrey Hodges, Doom 64 intro. Go ahead and play that bad boy. While we're clomping around the, the old fortress here. Get some tunes rolling. It's kind of quiet. It might pick up and get louder. I really can't hear that shit at all. But whatever. Not very important. Anyway, we can open up two of these doors. So we've got four batteries. Takes two to a door. So we can get probably two sentinel crystals. That's probably what I'm going to shoot for. <coughs> cough, cough. And I just got a trophy. Hell yeah. Homemaker. I know you can't see the trophies pop up, but I sure can, damn it. And that is all that matters. Anyway, what should I upgrade? Um, Let's see. We could use some more ammo. Ammo is always good, but then again, health and armor are also... They're all three equally good. So I don't really know which of these I want. Uh, I'm kind of feeling some health, I think. Some more health would definitely be, be good. And this could, yeah, demons drop armor at a faster rate. I could get this perk. Because all I would have to do is open up another one of the doors. Let's get this going. That'll give me some health and some ammo. Two of which are, are useful things. So let's go open this one up. I don't really, I don't know how many more of these doors there are to open. Um, these might be the last ones, aside from the two up there that I haven't opened yet. And I'll probably, depending on how much longer this game is, I might get around to opening those. We'll have to see. Depends on what I feel like doing. Like I said, you know, I'm not really a connoisseur of doing optional stuff and finding all of the hidden items and secrets in each mission. I'm, I, I'm more so just kind of like to go through the game and beat it, beat the missions, and have fun playing at my own pace and whatnot. Uh, Alright, so let's get this. That'll give us a good old ammo upgrade. Alright, now we've only got two more perks before we're maxed out. I think I'm going to take a look around the ship real quick and see if there's any more doors I can open, aside from the two that I already mentioned. Which, um, we'll get to when we get to, more than likely. Uh, which way should I go? I wonder how you get this. You might you might have to, like, do, like, optional encounters and whatnot to unlock whatever this weapon is. I'd like to unlock it, but my track record with doing optional stuff is super shitty. So I might not get around to doing it. Uh, Alright, yeah, we've already got these opened up. We've got this one we could open up. Later, that is. I don't know. I feel like there's still more to this ship that I haven't explored yet. But that might just be me thinking things that aren't exactly accurate. I have no idea. Well, anyway, let's just jump into the next mission. Fuck it. Also, the portal is red now. I'm pretty sure it was blue before, so that's a little bit foreboding. Just a teensy bit. Let me get my weapons situated here. Boop, here we go. Mission time! Saving! Please wait! Tara Taras Nabad. Uh, with the death of her priests, the blood ritual has been broken. The con maker, desperate for a way to consume Earth, is attempting to resurrect the Icon of Sin under her command. Only the Slayer's Crucible Blade can stop the Icon. To retrieve it, you must journey back into your past, the city of Tarasnabad, where your legend began. Sweet. That sounds pretty cool. We might get to learn more about the Doom Slayer. Just like we did in that, uh, the last couple of videos. 
That was just a bunch of lore. The Titan that attacked this Sentinel City. Your first battle against the demons in this world. Where the legend of the Slayer began. The legend of the Slayer began. Man, I like how every level in this whole game just has such a distinct and different look to it. I just, I absolutely love the level design of this game. I love the way the levels are laid out. I love the way that they look. Love everything about the level design. Hey, Codex entry. Taras Nabad, who's ready for some reading? <clears throat> All right. The city of Taras Nabad was the crown jewel of Argent Dinur. For centuries, it served as the spiritual heart of Argent society, home to both the royal family and the center of political power. No expense was spared in the building of the city, with bold col colonnaded. I've never seen that word before. Uh, the colonnaded architecture and towering monuments to gods and kings resplendent. God, there are some crazy words in the writing in this game that I just suck at. Rural Argenta flocked to Taras Nabad on pilgrimage to the Maker Temples. The city was ground zero of a massive demonic invasion attempt, and although the invasion was thwarted, the attack changed Argenta society forever. Alright, that was what it looks like. That was pretty. That is pretty. It's also where we are, so looking at the picture was kind of stupid. But pfft. There you go. Out of my way. Zombie looking bitch. Oh, we got a Cyberman over there. Hi, Cyberman. Cyberman Cubis. With a Cyber Plan Cubis. Alright, let's go deal with this asshole. Ugh, there goes his armor. Man, these guys suck without their armor. I thought the Cyber Mancubus was going to be, like, way tougher of an enemy. Uh... What was the deal with this thing? I'm probably supposed to mess with that after I clear the area. Alright, yep, there we go. So what do I do here? Boop! Got that one. Got that one. Is that all I had to do? Hit both of them at once? Oh, what the fuck? Get out of here! Oh, great, it's this guy! I remember fighting this guy at the fucking beginning of the game. Alright, hold on, hold on now. Let me get some shit rolling here. This guy's attacking me with weird attacks. I don't understand. Let me get rid of all these, like, peon enemies first. These pieces of shit that are just gonna get in my way. Alright, I'm low ammo. So let's switch to the, the Ballista. So I remember how to fight this guy. Yeah, you gotta, like... Yeah, like pull some some strats on this guy. Yeah, I'll just blast him. See what happens. Oh shit! Yeah, you gotta wait for the the green thing, or you can probably just shoot him without that. Eh. You got a flamethrower, you sack of shit, and and a grenade. Give me that armor. Oh, that was good. That was, it was, was kind of good. Here, uh, the, the chain gun. This is always a good option. Trying to attack me with his stupid dog thing. Alright, he's dead. He is fucking gone. See you later. I don't even remember what those guys are called. I remember the Doom Slayers, or Doom Hunters, but not those guys. According to the Korax Temple, the city would have been lost had it not been for the arrival of the Slayer. The hell? Who was shooting at me? Apparently that guy. Did I hit him? Alright, good. I didn't know about that second shot. Whoop, monkey bars. I need some ammo stat right now, real quick. So someone is getting chainsawed. Whether they like it or not, it is not up to them. First enemy I see. Where do I go now? Where in Carmen San Diego am I supposed to go? Am I supposed to go, like, down there? That looks like death. I go down there. Let's give it a shot. Yeah, that's definitely pseudo death. What am I supposed to do here? What am I supposed to do? All right. Well, this is where the doors opened originally. So I'm back over here. Is there nothing over there? What's the point of monkey barring over there if there's? This is. Hold on. I will figure. Okay, I f fuck that up real good. I fucked up. There we go. Alright, now that I'm over here, what do I do? 
It looks like I need to... Let's try monkey barring this way. See what that does. Alright, well this is doing something. Okay, well I found a secret. I found the BFG Division. Oh, dude, BFG Division was my favorite song in Doom 2016. That was my favorite track in that game. I love the BFG Division. Ooh. Um... Yeah, I don't know where to go, though. I mean, I found a secret, but... In terms of the main routes... Uh, uh, oh, I thought I was gonna miss that. Yeah, what do I do... Here? Like, uh, I feel like this door is supposed to open or something, but it's it's not open. Hello? I need guidance. I might have to edit this out. If I get too confuzzled. Am I supposed to get up there? Maybe? Huh. Alright, let's try... The only thing I can think to do is... Use those monkey bars again. Oh, there's a climbable wall right there. I'm a dingus, dude. I'm a dingus McStingus. I was think I was wondering, I was like, what am I supposed to do? Alright, we need a chainsaw. Oh, I can chainsaw Mancubus. I didn't even know I could do that. I guess my ammo has been upgraded, so... I have enough fuel to do that now. That's pretty sweet. Kind of forgot about that little mechanic. The more you upgrade your ammo capacity, the bigger enemies you're allowed to chainsaw. Kind of, uh... You do that in the last Doom game, too. Oh god, that guy scared the shit out of me. Do 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 What did that guy... Oh, what is... He's like, what the fuck? I thought he dropped something. I thought there was, like, an item floating there. Oh my god, I fucking bit it. I just ate shit. I thought I was gonna, like, get a fucking mountain of armor from killing those dudes. And then I would just ride that to victory, but nope. There were some very hard-hitting enemies wailing on me. Kind of cornered myself there. Alright, let's try that again with a little bit more testosterone pumping through me. A little bit less sloppy shenanigans here. Eh. Alright, well, he's fucking dead. Go ahead and take out my ballista. Pull out my... Oh, how did that guy survive a ballista shot? I know I, like, hit him in the foot. But hold, hold, hold your horses there. It was the ballista. This is the ballista we're talking about. Is there a buff totem nearby? Is that what's going... Oh, yeah, these guys are buffed. Okay, I did not see the message where it said there was a buff totem nearby. I did not see that message. Let's see if we can find this bad boy. I'm gonna go over here. Yeah, it's definitely not in here. This is a good place to get cornered, though. So I'm gonna try and get banana split out of there. Yeah, where's this buff totem at? These sons of bitches are not going to remain buff while I doom slay this this necropolis. Do I have a triple dash now? Yeah, my dash refills really quick. Where's this buff totem? Damn it! I found an auto map. Does that show me where the buff totems are? As if I die, I could check. The buff totems are usually in pretty weird places, though. So, I don't know. Oh, I could melee this open. Uh, that is not the buff totem. That is a secret encounter. What is this? Where does this lead? What is that? Okay, what did I just do? I found a secret, apparently. If it's not a buff totem, I don't give a fuck. I don't even know where the secret is. I'll have to, like, clear the arena before I find it. There we go. Alright, where's this buff totem? Where is it? Is that... No, that's a... That's a suit. Not a rad suit. What the hell am I supposed to do with this? I mean, I'm guessing the game wouldn't just put a rad suit there for no fucking reason. There must be something to do with it. Okay, there's nothing... Okay, no, 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 I'm cornered. I am so fucked. I am so fucked. I can't find this totem. I don't think it's in there. That'd be kind of twisted. Oh my god, yeah, I'm fucked. I need to heal. Yeah, I'm dead. There's no two ways about it. I really wish that I could figure out where this fucking totem is at. I'm, like, hauling ass around this map searching. I don't know, there, there must be some kind of, like, weird 
secret to finding this one. Do I have to go through? Wait, what is this? Why is it pointing me to the statue? The fuck? I'm gonna go over there real quick and try and haul ass into that portal. Oh, hey, there's health right here. Pick it up! That'll get me through a, a little bit. Oh god, oh yeah, that's fire. I don't know what the deal is with that fire. Alright, well, plan B. Let's go over to the statue. Yeah, there's nothing over here. It is pointing me up here for some reason. The game is like, yes, go up here. I don't know why. I don't know where this totem is. Where the fuck is this stupid buff totem, goddammit? Like, at this point, I should probably just, like... Like, oh, the enemies are gonna infinitely spawn until I find this fucking thing, though. That's the problem. So I... I have gotta figure this out. One way or another. I don't know how, but it's gotta happen. Hey, I found the secret. Uh, mastery tokens allow you to bypass whatever those are. Oh, okay, so it just kinda lets you skip having to do weapon challenges for... Uh, like the better upgrades. Yeah, I seriously wish that I could figure out where this uh, uh, fucking buff totem was at. But I cannot find it, and I am searching high and low. High and low. Like, I don't know, does it, has it not spawned in yet? Or do I need to kill a certain amount of enemies to make it spawn? Like, I, I have no idea. Let's just try killing some shit. See what happens. Maybe it'll spawn in if I kill enough enemies. Because right now, I'm just not even seeing the fucking thing. I am not even seeing it. I would like to see it. I mean, the game is like, hey, check out that statue up there. Oh, God. I don't even know. There's so much red on my screen. I don't even know what's happening. I'm dead. Yeah, I don't know what the deal is with this buff totem. I can't find it. I don't know, maybe uh, there's a vague chance that I, it could be a glitch. I mean, I'm assuming I'm just an idiot, but... If it is a glitch, that maybe reloading the checkpoint might buff it out. As we'll find out. I have no idea where the fuck this buff totem's at. Unless... Is there like a certain enemy that's buffing everything in this area? It might be a certain enemy that I just need to target and take out. That's kind of what I'm thinking it might be. Now that I, I think about it. But I, yeah, let's just try to find like a, a super duper enemy. Alright, who is doing the, these, these buffing tactics? Uh, Alright, well I'm going to BFG my way to victory real quick. I need some health and ammo and gear. Alright, who wants who wants to ammo my ass up? I like buffed that guy by hitting him. I don't know if I don't think that's actually what happened, but you know. What is happening here? What is that? What is that? What is that thing that they're doing? When they spawn in? I don't understand. I don't know what's happening anymore. All I know is that buff enemies are, are coming and they're coming strong. Ugh! Alright, I want to use my last... No, what the fuck? I'm so cornered. Alright, well, I have to use my last BFG shot. I'm like, no choice. That or die. Uh, oh, yeah, I need to blood punch this dude, which I don't think I can do. Yeah, he's going to kill me. He's definitely going to kill me. What is causing all these enemies to spawn? Little me that, Batman. There's got to be a, a totem nearby. And I just don't know where it is or how to destroy it. I mean, I know how to destroy it. I just don't know where it is. That's the that's the shit thing here. Get over here, you sack of shit. There we go. All right, you get the saw. My micro missiles for some some added potential firepower. All right, I need to figure out where the fuck this totem is. What is this thing over here that's just glowing? It's an enemy. I wish I could figure out what the fuck was going on. Is this the guy that's causing everything to get buffed? This must be the guy. This is our culprit here. 
I think. I hit him. Yeah, I think this this guy's the one causing all this confusion and shenanigans. And he's taking forever to die. Right, there he goes. Okay, I ended up killing us. Okay. Phased through that mancubus. Okay, yeah, that was the enemy that was that was causing me to be all confused and shit. It wasn't no totem, it was just a fucking piece of shit asshole buffing his teammates. Playing the support class real good. Alright, now we're back in it, baby. We're back in it for real this time. I am I have no time to, to die. I'm James Bond. No time to die. Alright. Fed that guy is hard. That cat oh I thought that cacodemon was still alive. Cool, alright. Well, once I figured out what I actually needed to do, that fight was pretty simple. Shut up, Samuel Hayden. Fucking dickhead. Betraying our asses in the last game. Spoiler alert. <laughs> I mean, if you haven't played Doom 2016 yet, God help you. It's an amazing game. I would highly recommend playing it. And then, you play this game. And then you have even more fun. Uh, b -b -b how do I get in there? How do I get in there, huh? Huh? Let me go back up here. So... Um... Oh, what the fuck? Alright. That opens this up. For a big pool of radioactive fun. Does that, like, do anything to actually help me? That doesn't open that door or anything. What's the point of... of oh, I'm supposed to swim? What the fuck? They're swimming in this game. Water dashing is the only way to destroy breakables. How the fuck do I dash? Like, okay, you just press B. There we go. Alright, I did not think there would be swimming in this game. Hopefully it's not clunky as shit. Alright, I'll take that. So what, are we just like, going through and draining this these swampy ruins here? I break through this? Eh! I cannot break through that. I better get, get the fuck out of here. How do I get out of here? How do I get out of the water? Oh my god. What the fuck? Alright. How do I uh, uh, get out of the water once I'm in it? How do I can I climb this? <gasps> All right. Yeah, already the swimming is a little bit clunky feeling. Hopefully, there's not too much of it, but that's kind of to be said about every video game. Swimming just sucks in in general in every game. How do I get the fuck out of here? I should just be able to like double jump out of here, but I can't. How do I get out of here? Do I have, like, unfinished business that I need to attend to? What the... I'm confused. Apparently there's something else I need to do down here. Uh, but I can't figure out what it is. Because I can't break through that. I'm dying, that's good. Eh, 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 eh. Alright, that was almost shitty. Yeah, I have no idea what the fuck to do now. Again, I had a bit of a, an impasse on... What am I supposed to do? I can't jump back. How come I can't jump out of here? The fuck? How am I supposed to get out of here? There's nothing but dead ends in this stupid sewer thing. It's all dead ends. Unless I can, like, get in here, which there's nothing in here. And... Okay, I mean, can I climb this side? I don't think I've tried this side yet. Alright, here we go. Yeah, I, I literally just got the exact same result. The exact same result. Okay. So... Yeah, what in the silly fuck am I supposed to do here? I am confused about that. Climb the wall, you dickhead. There we go. Um... Yeah, I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do here. This doesn't make any sense. I'm definitely gonna probably have to... Do I have to stand on this? And then, are, that, are you kidding me? That is so stupid. Alright, whatever. At least I figured it out. I had to stand on that, like, one brick that was slightly elevated above the floor. How the fuck do I open this? Ugh. I hate puzzles. <laughs> I hate puzzles, I really do. Alright, well, I'm gonna edit this out, and once I figure out what I'm supposed to do, I will... 
resume the recording.